Good afternoon, my name is John Brogan. I'm the Chief Recovery Specialist for our program and I'm also a person in long-term recovery. Um, if you have told me a little over five years ago that I would be here speaking today, no, no way. Um, I was sitting in the Salvation Army wondering what happened again after four Narcan reversals and attempted suicide and uh, no way. Um, this is a type of addiction along with all other addictions, a mental obsession followed by a physical compulsion rooted in a broken spirit. And until that is addressed, there is no shot at long-term recovery. Um, that's why I understand this disease and our recovery specialists. Um, it, it's, it, this is a must and, uh, and we're doing it. And uh, it, this journey has been unbelievable to me. There's a great responsibility that comes with this. Um, but each one of our recovery specialists, Dan, Angela, we, we take this personally and uh, the numbers speak for themselves. The fact is that, that this issue is an issue that affects families all over the state and uh, the idea of recovery coaches was an idea that our administration came up with, worked with our law enforcement folks, our folks in the healthcare system um, to see on a pilot basis whether it could make a difference or not. And the great news that we hear from Monmouth and Ocean County is that it's making a huge difference for these individuals and for their families. And so I proposed in our budget this year to expand the, the program. Um, we're going to look to expand it even further um, and look for partners in the private sector uh, to work with us as well. Uh, it's uh, very, very successful. Uh, and all you need to do is to meet some of the folks who have been impacted by folks like John and others intervening in their lives from the perspective of knowing exactly what it is to have this addiction. And that's why I think the Recovery Coach Program is so important. Uh, this is advice and counseling and help that comes from people who have been exactly where these folks are. And there's no way to substitute for that. Having gone through this uh, myself with a, a good friend of mine, um, trying to work with him and counsel him through 10 years of struggle with addiction, which ended in his death. Um, I understand as well as anybody um, that if you haven't been through it, it's almost like you're speaking a different language to the person who's sitting across from you. Even though um, I'd been friends with this, with this person for you know, over 20 years, and we knew each other as well as I knew anyone outside my family, I couldn't get through to him. And people like John can though is they understand what he's feeling inside and how to take those feelings and turn them into something productive to turn around his life.